Our school is a very special place. I hope you've noticed and felt that. I must be fair in saying it is probably my favourite topic of conversation. I am so proud of what each member of staff and each child has achieved over our journey to date. But our vision statement, those values that I just mentioned, are very much a living part of daily school life and the unique opportunity that we have had to create our school from scratch has enabled us to craft each of the opportunities very carefully from our curriculum to our approach to teaching and learning to our pastoral care and staff training. We have since the outset of our school regularly used the phrase beginning with the end in mind and it is that focus that ensures that all of our plans and our actions are deliberate the result of care, thoughtful, ambitious strategic planning and a real understanding of what can unlock a child's potential. Our vision and values put a real emphasis on realising potential and by this we mean excellence for all. Academic achievement and success in its many guises through supporting our young people to grow in confidence and self-belief and I think really is possible. We believe that hard work is to be valued and we do expect a lot from our students because it is only from hard work that the delight of real success, I believe, can truly be felt. You can see where that school rule of work hard and be nice, uh, be kind to people came from, can't you? But it's not just what we do, but how we do it, which really does set the Archer Academy apart. As parents, you want a school where your child can succeed, grasp opportunities, pass exams, be the best that they can be. But most importantly, you want them to be happy. You know, and we know, that young people thrive and grow in confidence when they feel supported and when they feel happy and secure at home and at school. At the Archer Academy, we know the importance of positive relationships and we're very good at it. Our students know that if they have a problem, there is someone that will listen. Equally, if they have an idea that they would like to explore, we will support them. Our students talk to us and we talk to them. This is a school where students know they can approach a member of staff in the corridor to ask for help, to ask or pose a thought-provoking question or simply to share some good news. Quality and meaningful communication is key here, built on mutual respect. We want to know if there are any issues which are affecting your child's welfare or progress. If you have any questions, queries or concerns, get in touch with us as soon as possible. In the first instance, that should be via your child's form tutor, a key person for you to get to know over the coming weeks. But please don't let things fester. Don't let things build up. Share them immediately because then we can work together, home and school as a powerful dynamic, to make a difference, to change things, to ensure that your child is front and centre. If you wish to talk to a member of staff, please contact us by email or by telephone. All teaching staff have a direct email address on the website. Please do have a look as soon as you get your child's timetable and make a record of them. We will always come back to you within 24 hours to discuss your question, query or concern or arrange a time to meet. That's often our preference. Please remember that when you leave a message or send an email that a member of staff is likely to be teaching throughout the day. Please know in confidence that they will get back to you. But please, as I said, don't let something fester. If you're worried, let us know. We will do the same and let you know if we are concerned. If something happens that sounds a little strange, please do check things out with us, as you will know that events, situations can get lost in translation. And that is why it is imperative that you keep in touch with us and ask us if anything you are unsure about. As that saying goes, and my experienced Archer powers will be very familiar with this phrase of mine, if you don't believe everything they say happened at school, we won't believe everything they say happened at home. Too true. But please tell us if we get something wrong, but tell us too if we get something right. Feedback is very useful. But know that we will always have the best interests of your child at heart. We may have to have difficult conversations sometimes, but it is how we work together, home and school unified, to support your child that is key. Listening to each other, as much as talking, is paramount here for all of us. We know how to do this well. Trust us. I would ask you, though, to support us here in ensuring that your contact details are kept up to date and that we're always able to reach you. I would also ask that you keep abreast of school information. 
that you read it carefully. The newsletter is sent out each Friday and provides a wealth of key information. But know please that I recognise the incredible responsibility that you have given to me and each member of my staff. Your child is incredibly precious. Know that I shall never forget that, that I shall ensure that myself and all of my staff take that responsibility so seriously so that they always achieve more than they ever thought possible with us.